Hey guys, Ashley Anderson here from Style 608 and I'm back with a part two of Chic Wish Fall Try On. I'm actually wearing one of the pieces now. I only have four more to show you so I will pop in and do like a little talk over thing when I try them on. I'm um, gonna also show you how I style them. I'll put them in a blog post so you guys can have savable, savable photos. God, I cannot talk today. So you guys can have savable, savable photos. So there will be a blog post. This will be up on IGTV and on my YouTube channel and I'll put the video on the blog post for you guys as well. So let's just jump right into it. First off is this sweater. This is so cute, so chunky, so heavy, so cozy. It has the most adorable little heart pom-pom deal details on it and like a really chunky knit. It's actually got a, like a pretty good stretch to it. Um, it does have like a little cuff around the arm and the bottom you know, it's kind of the same thing. It's a little bit more cropped fitting. Um, it just falls to like right to the top of my jeans. Obviously the collar is large enough to wear off the shoulder, which I love. I think it's just so warm and cozy and this color is just so, so beautiful. I love it. And it's perfect for fall and even winter because this is really heavy. I think this is my favorite sweater from the entire haul. These like little pom-pom hearts are just the cutest thing. It is a traditional V neck looks like this. The sleeves are like just long enough and hit my watch, but I think I like it better off the shoulder. I do have a bodysuit on underneath, but you can also just wear it off the shoulder regular if you want. I just have some rattan earrings on, um, booties to match, stuff with the black denim for the whole try on. I love this. This is like a really great length and this is a small and it's meant to be a little bit oversized in the top here like this. It's the same length all the way around. It has this really pretty knit on the bottom too. This would be great for Valentine's Day to dress up a sweater instead of wearing a dress because it's usually cold here in Wisconsin in February. Actually, it sucks in February. Um, but I really love this look. This is my favorite sweater. It does come in a bunch of different colors too, and it's really cozy. I'm sweating really bad right now. Next one is this leopard print oversized sweater. I really love this. This is so on trend. I've seen it at so many different vendors too, not just Chicwish. Uh, but it has a really nice plain color collar, nice long sleeves with a little cuff at the bottom. And at the bottom there also is a little cuffing as well. This color is really pretty. It's this tan and light brown color. I think this is gonna go with black so well. Blue jeans just beautifully. And it's got a really good stretch to it too. It is a pretty heavier sweater and it's really, really quality. I did order a small for both of these pieces and this one is meant to be oversized so don't size up. It's already pretty big. This is the oversized leopard sweater. It does have a balloon sleeve and it has a cinch on the end, but I actually really like it pulled up. This is a small, it's meant to be larger. I just paired it with some black earrings, black jeans, and black booties. Very simple, let the sweater do the talking. It's very cozy, very warm, I'm like sweating. This actually does have a little bit of weight to it as well, but the length I think is great. It's the same all the way around, hits just in the middle of the butt. It's probably not long enough for leggings, so that's why I put some denim on. I really like it. I think it's cute. You can definitely tuck it in if you wanted to. I think this look is really cute as well. It's just a cozy, like, throw on sweater. I'm ready for fall. Great to, like, throw on and go. You don't really need to do a whole lot of accessorizing with it just because the pattern is kind of bold. But yet the colors are pretty muted. You could throw on a black hat with this too. It would be really cute. This is a great just grab and go look. Perfect for fall. Great for transitioning. Also great for winter. And this pattern will be around for a little while. Next piece is a really pretty emerald green, which actually would look gorgeous with these earrings too. Outfit idea. Um, this is so heavy, you guys. Like this is like probably a good two to three pounds of sweater right here. And it's such a huge knit, like a really, really big knit. And it does have a little bit of a cuff on here. The collar is pretty high. Um, it does have a decent amount of stretch to it, but I don't think you can wear it off the shoulder. Uh, but it's pretty cropped too, so. This would look great with a pair of high-waisted denim. You can just tuck it in just a smidge, I think would be really cute too. But this color I'm so here for. And I mean, come on guys, green is my favorite color. If you don't know by now, now you know. This is the chunky green sweater. Like I said, it is super duper oversized. These are balloon sleeves and this is the small, so it is definitely oversized. There's enough fabric here that you could even knot it, but I would probably just do a front tuck and just wear it super slouchy casual goes great with these pink earrings i love it paired with some black denim i do have black loafers on here but i think adding a black booty or even like a taller boot would be just fine with this look too but it's super cozy so soft and i love this like large chunky like waffle knit this is so in right now 
Last piece, I have this in two other colors already, a cognac and a gray. So naturally I needed it in a linen, but it does also come in a blush and a burgundy. Um, most of these pieces other than the leopard print sweater come in alternate colors too. This sweater, I actually call it a jacket, but this is like the perfect fall transition jacket. It has a nice lapel on the front here. It has a cuffing around the arms, a faux pocket, which is the only downfall. It is a pretty like thin material, but it's great over a sweater just as that little extra added layer of warmth. And it's great. And this color is so, so wonderful. I have a hat that would go so great with this. And you just need all the neutrals. I honestly need a black and I would be completely set. I've got the gray, I've got the cognac, got the linen, just need the black and it would be great. This has like a minimal stretch to it. And there are sizing in like the sizing for this is like small, medium, large, extra large. So I got the small medium for this. And then um, that green sweater I also did get in a small too. This is the linen jacket. As mentioned, I also have it in cognac and I have it in a gray color as well. But I just pictured this like throw over for a quick like pumpkin patch day or lunch in the fall. So paired with a cute hat, some black denim and some white sneakers. Uh, I just think this is so casual. It's just a great extra added layer. I love how it lays in the front. It's not super boxy or bulky. I just do wish that there were real pockets. That's the only drawback. But there's a nice little like hem detail here that kind of keeps everything together and it almost does have like a waffle knit pattern to it as well but it's really cozy really comfy uh, it's a little bit shorter in the back and a little bit longer in the front but just a great casual staple for any look in the fall great transition jacket too that's all i have for now from chic wish and thank you again chic wish for sending me all these pieces i so so appreciate it and i love making these videos for you these are so much fun for me to do and i love doing the try-ons thank you guys so so much for watching i really appreciate it be sure to subscribe uh, this video will be on YouTube, IGTV, and in the blog post. So you can shop everything and just see how I would style it. And that's it. Be sure to check out Style 608 and subscribe to all my social media. You can find it all on there. And I will see you all in my next video. Bye!